Ever wish your Mac looked cleaner f oh, hell no, man. for a screenshot, a screen recording, or just had a minimal setup? Well, in this quick tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can hide all your desktop icon in just a few seconds without having to delete anything. Now, you might be wondering, why would I even want to do this? Well, here are a few reasons why. Maybe let's say you're in a meeting and you're sharing your screen with others. You probably don't want to share your personal files or projects. Or you just want to boost productivity and focus. Having a messy desktop can be quite distracting, so it's better to hide the icons in that case. Now, without further ado, let's get into how to do this. So to do this, we're going to be using the terminal app on our MacBook. The terminal app allows us to communicate with macOS using the command line interface. To open up terminal, what you're going to do is look for a black icon in your dock. It looks something like this. If you can't find it, no worries. Simply press command space on your keyboard and type terminal. This will open up the terminal app. And we're going to be utilizing the default write command, essentially telling macOS we're modifying some system settings. So let's type default write. And the specific setting that we're going to be modifying is for the Finder app. And the Finder app has a unique identifier called com.apple.finder. And then in that Finder app, we're going to be modifying the desktop icon specifically, or the, or the desktop. And so we will want to hide the desktop icon. So let's type create desktop and set that to false. And then finally type kill all finder. This will restart finder and make the changes go into effect immediately. As you can see, our icons have been hidden. But if we go over to our finder, we can still see that they're here in our desktop. It's just that they are now hidden. If you want to bring them back, all you have to do is run the same command again, but change the false flag to true. And one good thing about Terminal and other Unix shells is that they have a history and they can remember previous commands you've ran. So if you were to just simply press the up arrow, you can see that the command that we just ran has come back. And all you have to do is now change the false flag to true to bring the icons back. And as you can see, the icons have now returned. And one good thing is that the history saves it even if you close the terminal app. So if I was to quit out the terminal app and then relaunch the terminal app and then press the up arrow, you can see that the command is still saved. And you can see the icons are gone just like that. And now one question that I always get asked about this is, does this change persist even if I restart my MacBook? And the answer is yes, this change persists even if you restart your computer. If you want to get your icons back, all you have to do is run this command again and change the false flag to true. One bonus tip is if you find yourself running this command quite often, you can actually create a simple shell script to do this for you. Let me know if you want a full tutorial on that, by the way. But that's pretty much it on how you can uh, hide your desktop icons. That's it, a super simple way to hide all your desktop icons without having to delete anything in just a matter of a few seconds. If this video helped you, make sure to give it a like, share this video with friends and family, comment down below if you have any questions regarding this video or any other tech topic, and I'll gladly help out. And make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.